actually the mayor. There actually does sound the lobes I just threw around. Microphone! <laughs> Hello, dwellers, and welcome to a Neander Mail. It's been quite a while, so that's awesome. Um, I'm actually here today to uh, say a few things first. So this is more like a Neander vlog mail. So, hopefully you'll be fine with that. Um, I wanted to, uh, answer a few questions and some other statements, too, because this week is pretty exciting and tedious. Excitingly exceedious. It's exceedious. In one week, I'll be on a plane to Orlando, Florida to MINECON 2013, and hopefully you guys will be going, too. If not, I'll be doing, you know, vlogs and stuff there. Um, hopefully, you know, this MineCon will be... A little bit more, uh, I guess, positive than last Minecon. Um, but I'm looking forward to it. I get to see a lot of my friends, some friends I haven't seen before in real life. And I'll be able to meet my fans and all that stuff, shake hands, and give you guys some toys, maybe. Uh, sign a few t-shirts that are going to be given off at a booth. And it'll be just lots of fun. So, hopefully, guys, you're excited for that, because I, <laughs> I sure am. And actually, speaking of Minecon, I'm working really, really hard on this music video that's going to hopefully premiere at the Minecon opening ceremony. I'm really, really looking forward to, like, just getting my butt into gear. I've been, like, uh, talking with lots of people to help get this project done. And, uh, I'm really excited for it. Uh, this is probably the most amount of work I've ever put into anything ever. Um, because <laughs> I'm doing a lot of the animating myself. I'm the singer of it. Um, you know, and stuff like that, so, it's, it's a pretty big deal, and, uh, there's a cat behind me. Hello, kitty cat! Come back here, come back! So, yeah, I'm working on a music video, and hopefully it'll be done at Minecon. I will feel so bad if it's not done by Minecon. Um, I've got people helping me, I've got Russ playing, he's, uh, helping with the animation, um, Element Animation's helping with, like, lip syncing and stuff, he's awesome. You should check both of them out, they're gonna be in the description below! Secrets of the Dwellers! Where is it, caveman? I've been waiting! The reason why it hasn't been out... Cat again. So, yeah, just kind of waiting to get, like, a good server up, uh, make sure the building team's still there, because, uh, the same building team that I'm using for the music video, they've been busy with that, and other things are working on a server of mine, and they're working on other people's servers, because, you know, I don't own them, and they're not my property, they're just helping me. So, uh, that's kind of been the problem, and, uh, yeah. I do feel really bad, and I want to, as soon as I get back from Minecon and get the music video done, I'm going to be doing Secrets of the Dwellers again, and I'm going to either A, tone down on the quality so that I can make it either a weekly or bi-weekly series again, or B, just... Make it bi-weekly, but make it awesome! So, hopefully we can do the latter more than the former. But if not, that's enough. Here's the intermail! There's lots of it. Uh, I haven't read these in a while. I actually kind of have a box full now. We're going to be doing the intermail every week starting from uh, next Minecon. Or like, after Minecon. Because, well, I might even be able to do it, you know, during Minecon. If people hand me mail at Minecon. And then I'll read it at the hotel room at Minecon. And that'd be kind of cool at Minecon. But the first one is a letter. Go green! Reduce our environmental footprint. There's a green dog on it. Green dog. And it's from uh, John Moo. So he's a cow. Uh, from New England. Oh, I, no, 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 no. He's from North... Oh, that's, that's a road. Northeast or New England. But not... This time, it means Northeast. Uh, Portland, Oregon. Yes, indeed. So let's open it, and we shall see the thing that is taped. He taped it. It's like, you don't want to get in this, huh? <laughs> I, w I, I made sure the letter was in the bottom half. I didn't rip it in half, trust me. Wow, this is a pretty longly worded letter. Holy crap. Hello, caveman. I am a huge fan of yours, and I watched many of your videos. I think your videos are awesome. However, I'm not there for that. I'm writing about Secrets of the Dwellers! Uh, 
I think those episodes are amazing and they are the best videos you've made. Coincidentally, I was thinking about videos using Minecraft even before I watched your videos. When I watched them, I was very impressed by their quality. I'm glad that you're taking your time and making these videos and not pan pandering to the complaining fans. I like creative thinking and I've always wanted to be a part of the movie or part of a movie. As this may imply, I don't feel a special urge to be in the video. I am perfectly content of working behind the scenes. All I really want is a place on the work crew. Uh, even though I'm not awesome at making maps, I'd just be as happy working in a build team. Uh, I'm flexible and happy to do anything that is necessary. Thank you for reading this, and please consider my offer. John Mio. Oh, Mio, not Moo. <laughs> the E and the O it look the same, okay? A hello from a dweller. Next one! Read this letter first, caveman. I should have done that, but I didn't. It has dogs on it, though. You see? Doggies! And bones! I had to rip the doggies in half. <laughs> I'm so sorry, doggy! Call Peter. Call Peter right now! Call Peter right now! So after murdering those dogs, I got stuff. Ooh. It's like an anime head. Look at it this. It's actually really well drawn, even though she only has one eye. Maybe her eye is being covered by her bangs. Vigorous erasing. Couldn't get the eye right. Ah, okay. Like it? Yeah, I love it. It's, it's great. That's actually really well drawn. Wow, I'm just getting... <laughs> I'm getting, like, biographies. It's awesome. Okay. <clears throat> Dear Caveman Films, I love your videos. You are so funny, and it's really awesome that you don't cuss. My name is Ashley, and I live in Tennessee. If you don't mind, I have a few questions for you. What made you decide to do YouTube? Um... Well, I guess I'll just answer that, because the next one's just another question. Um, what did I do to decide to do Mewtwo? But what did I do to the, uh, to do, to do, do, do YouTube? <laughs> um, well, let's see. Now, back in the day, I played this game called RuneScape, and, um, there was this, uh, guy there that was a really famous YouTuber, um, who was probably the first person on, uh, RuneScape to decide to do machinima style videos using the game and he was called Tanoob Show. Now, I was like 12 at the time. I'm like 20 now, so it was a while ago. It was back in uh, middle school or stuff. And um <clears throat> like I just saw his videos and that like really inspired me. So I made a crappy knockoff account called The Froob Show. <laughs> and it was terrible. It was horrendous. It was bad. But I mean, when I got a little older, I realized, hey, I shouldn't be trying to spoof off anyone else, so I should be my own person. So I made Caveman Films, and I decided to start doing my own thing, and via RuneScape, I managed to get about 3,000 subscribers, which I was really impressed with, because first off, RuneScape doesn't have that big of a uh, subscriber base, and um, just stuff like that. And so that was really cool. And then I started playing Minecraft in high school. And I was like, whew, this game's fun! And I was like, what if I could transfer my RuneScape Machinima knowledge to Minecraft? And so I did, and I made uh, The Curse of Herobrine, which has gotten over a million views, and that completely went, wow. People like Minecraft. People, like, I like playing Minecraft, and I like making videos of Minecraft. And I kind of want to get back to doing Machinimas. That's kind of one of the reasons why I like doing Secrets of the Dwellers. But the thing is, I have an eye for quality. I don't want to put out bad content when I'm actually working hard on it. So, you know, that happens. And uh, it kind of sucks because I know you guys really want to see the next episode. And I want to do the next episode. But sometimes, you know, things just don't click or things just go wrong or things just delay stuff or you get busy with something else like I've been working 24-7 on this music video that's supposed to be out in a week and we've only gotten like 10 seconds done because things and uh, <laughs> it's pretty it's pretty tough but um, I, I really just I love to entertain people and honestly if I could in my life if I didn't have YouTube as a career because that's the second one she asks me uh, what, what what's my job besides YouTube and YouTube is my job guys uh, you guys have um, really really made a large impact on my life probably larger than you'll ever think um I used to live in a uh, trailer when my mom was on disability and all this stuff before she passed away and so I mean 
I can I can make a living for myself now. I can go to places. I can meet people. I can have fun, and I can I have like this astounding astounding fan base that you guys are that support me and help me out and make my life possible. And it's really really amazing how much you guys do just by watching my videos on YouTube. And uh, gosh, you guys don't know how much I really appreciate you guys. And I really am sorry that there haven't been as many videos or series you don't you liked have been cancelled and stuff. Speaking of which, Pokemon X and Y, I'm still working on that. I'm still working on that. It's not done. It's just that every time I upload it, um, YouTube's derped on it. And so tomorrow, which would be Sunday, the day after this video goes up, there's probably going to be like an hour to two hour long episode of Pokemon that will uh, go from the first gym... Well, from where we started off, or started, you know, beginning, the ending of Castel, or not Castellia, that's black and white. The, the, <laughs> the, the part of Lumios that we left off from, and we'll go all the way to Sil or Silage City, which is the second gem. Um, and that'll be a very long time, because there's a very large gap between those two points. And I don't know why the rest of the game isn't like that, but it is, and look at me on a tangent about Pokemon! I like the Pokemon! No, no, no. I'm checking Skype in the middle of a recording, but you don't know this because I'm ch I'm just it. More mail! Okay, so, this mail is from Ian Pickin, from California! I was in California, and I was actually thinking about moving there, but, uh, I think I'll stay here for a while longer. Let's see what Ian has to say. There's stuff in it, which I, you, you can tell because I shook it around a lot. <gasps> Candy! He gave me some candy. <laughs> this is probably drugged. Okay, what else does he have in here? Um, more candy. Actually, we've got uh, we got some Werther's originals. Uh, we've got oh, you can't see it. We got some. Eh. Look, look at the candy. We got Werther's originals. We got peppermints. We got a root beer lollipop barrel. I hope. It better be root beer. If it's, it's if it's grape, I will not like you because grape is torture. That's not a that's not a treat. Ooh. Dear Caveman Films, as you can tell, I'm not the best writer ever. Oh, you're fine. He really is. Uh, <clears throat> ever. Uh. But I am your number one fan. If you write back, please use your real name. I would like to know when your next Secret to the Dwellers is. Uh, I gave you candies. I don't know which one you like, so I gave you all of them. Oh, I don't quite understand our survive. What? I don't know what that means. Candy, Ian. I will definitely eat the, the, uh, the root beer barrel. If it's root beer, if it's grape, it's going out. I'm not gonna lie. Grape flavored lollipops, not the best in the world. They're not the worst. They're just not the best. It's the itty bitty one, and I bet it's from Hannah Teague. She likes to send me mail. I like Hannah Teague. She sent me an Easter bunny uh, and a basket, and I recorded that, but then something happened to the footage. That's that's another reason why things come out late, because it's a, it's a drawing. Like a really good drawing. Holy crap. You guys ready? Look at this. Holy crap! It's great! I love it! Caveman! From Hannah Teague to Caveman Films. Dan. I hope you like it. It's all hand drawn and colored. And it took me a while to do. Thanks for making awesome vids. Ah, it's so awesome! Look, I got a I got a sword in my my uh, my left hand. Is it left hand? Or is it my right hand? It's my right hand. It's my right hand is a sword, left hand's club. Wait, this one. This one has to be open because it says, PLEASE OPEN ON THE ENDERMAIL. See, it's right there. Right there. Right there. It's weird. Like, the camera makes my eye look lazy. I'm not, I don't have a lazy eye. I swear to God. It's just a camera. The camera's a lazy camera. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Opening up a package. I can't tell what's on it. I, c I can't tell what's on it. Oh, now I can. Okay. Hello, Cave Dan. I love watching your videos. I watch them every single day. You are one of the only YouTubers I've seen that doesn't swear a lot. Well, thank you. 
I love your videos with Ant Venom, so please keep making those. I'm going through tough times because my dad isn't home during the business week. Your videos put a smile on my face and keep me happy. I bookmarked your channel on my iPad, so I have an application on my home screen that goes to your channel. Oh, that's awesome. I'm hoping to follow in your footsteps and make my own videos. If you could please do a shout out to Matthew and Andrew Brooks, that would be great. So I, I just shout out to Matthew and Andrew Brooks. I'd love to do an adventure map with you. Thank you for doing what you do. You should be at 200 million subscribers. Let's make that happen, guys. I have one question, so here it is. Are you going to Minecon in New York City? Once again, thanks. Also, when you do the shout out, can it please be in one of your videos with Van Finnum? If not, oh, if not just on me, oh, okay. It's just not just on, he, he means that if I didn't do it here, I would do it in a video with Ant but I did it here, so it's okay. Um, well, he kind of threw me for a loop when he said that Minecon was in New York City, but I am going to Minecon, as you guys, you know, heard already. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'll be at Minecon and I'll be doing stuff. So, if you guys see me around, make sure you stop me, swarm me, punch me, no punch, don't, don't, don't punch me. I, I can't even do this right. I can't, I can't do it. It's pretty. It says man films. Oh, there's a cave up at the top. Cave man films. I love it when I get fan art that depicts me causing murder. But, um, yeah, I think that's the end for Neander Mail. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I know it wasn't, like, it's long overdue. I mean, I have a whole box of backlog of mail, which I haven't done yet. So, you know, that's a problem. But, um,. Yeah, I really enjoy, like, uh, reading all your letters and stuff, so keep on sending them. If you do want to send me any fan mail, my P.O. Box is down there in the description. You can just send it to me, you know, format it correctly, and I'll get it. And eventually, <laughs> um, I'll open it and on camera and read it, and that'll be awesome. <laughs> Bye.